what's going on everybody welcome back to the channel it's your boy Lil Clickly welcome to another smoke a cigar with me video sorry my camera's a little crooked I I keep getting my camera crooked for some reason <clears throat> yeah I'll just have to do if you're new here my name is Lil Clickly I have high functioning autism but this time I'm not gonna be smoking from a cigar I'm gonna be smoking from a pipe to do a little pop out of Salem man action um I got a lot of these pipe tobacco samples from a friend of mine at church um <clears throat> Sorry about that. Um, which is good because I'm out of cigars. Um, and this is called Peterson of Dublin. The flavor is sweet. Kilinar Killarney. A lot of these actually are. Really <clears throat> and they also last longer. The last when I first started smoking from a tobacco pipe, I went I, the tobacco I first got was from a vape shop. It didn't really last long, and I don't think it really gave. <clears throat> as much of a flavor as this one did. Like you can smell how good it is. Um, <clears throat> the hard part, um, here's a tip I have for everyone. Make sure you... What was that? Sorry, I thought someone was on the camera. <clears throat> Don't um, stuff it in there because it won't get a good blow. And also, make sure... thumb for this make sure that you clean it every now and then so the ash doesn't build up and also don't stuff it down there because then it might be hard to light you want to make sure you have a good amount of the tobacco in the pipe <clears throat> um <clears throat> It's like a whole can of it. I love this. I mean, the people at the, the vape shop were really nice. But yeah, this guy who got this off from the piping plant. I want to try that shop. I just got to find someone to take me on. <clears throat> Hopefully, I will not have to deal with that anymore. I'm getting real sick and tired of having to get somebody to drive me around. I'm this close to the switch and just calling a lift. And then just, <clears throat> unless I have to, I have someone to go somewhere. Or if they just want to take me somewhere just to hang out. But, um... <clears throat> Other than that, I'm this close to saying just riding a lift because I want to practice more on driving. I don't really have a lot of people to <clears throat> take me a lot except for my friend Marshall. I did talk to another friend. Um, <clears throat> I haven't heard back from him. I talked to some other people too. Ouch. Ah, uh, burn a hole in my shirt. <clears throat> That's just great. There's another tip. Make sure you don't put too much in over the top either. Or you might have some hot <clears throat> piece of tobacco fly over you. And then you want to wait. Um, this is just from a video I learned that my boss from Murder Rooter sent me. You want to wait until it's all... <clears throat> the first layer burns let it burn out on its own you might have to light it several times but that's the fun part about lighting a cigar mm. uh, <clears throat> blister did I Um, <clears throat> so, um, driving is kind of the main subject that I wanted to talk about, um, and also cars, um, as you guys know, I kind of, at the first time, gave up my dream to own a BMW, because I felt like maybe God wanted, they didn't, it was wise because that's what God wanted me to do. 
But ever since like me and Jermaine have been talking about restoring my E46 3 Series, I've kind of gone back to having a BMW collection. So sometimes I want to like, <clears throat> I feel like maybe that's God rewarding me for being willing to give up my dream. And now he's letting me take it back, you know. Because the Lord works in mysterious ways and sometimes he like <clears throat> reveals stuff to us. We just don't see it right away. Oh, I got a blister on my knuckle. Oh, great. I hear blisters. Um, <clears throat> and I feel like maybe God's reward. That's my reward from God. I'm gonna. God maybe saw that. Maybe it was a test, and God saw that I willingly gave it up. He figured, okay, I'll let you go back to it. Because every BMW I have. Um, <clears throat> ah, that gum spot on my foot. Keeps bugs keep interrupting the moment. Um. I, uh, <clears throat> I, uh, <clears throat> every BMW that I own, I'm going to use it to glorify the Lord and use it to do His work. <clears throat> I didn't even get a Mini Cooper too, because I like Minis as well. I grew up around them and BMW. Mm. I just wasn't as satisfied. I looked at other vehicles. I just wasn't really like as satisfied as I was with the BMWs. But I kept looking anyway because you, you know, when God wants you to do something, you do it. And I felt like He saw how willing I was and was letting me go back. mixing the tobacco around here you want to mix the tobacco when you put on the put on the when you put on the the first time you want to mix it together because all the broken down ash actually helps it light better the second time okay hopefully this time I don't burn myself <clears throat> Ow! That gum, I keep burning myself today. Light it again. No, 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 no. Ow. Uh. <sighs> Sorry, y'all trying not to have a mental breakdown in front of the camera. shirts <clears throat> oh, that gum getting my blisters everywhere now <clears throat> there 
we go. Um, back to the subject. Before it was rudely interrupted by me. Blooming pipe. <laughs> um... Um, I plan on using the, all of my BMWs to help glorify the Lord and do His work. Um, my collection will be kind of simple, like maybe an X5, an X6, and then as far as regular cars go, maybe a 6 Series and a 328, 3 Series BMW, the, la the 2007 to 2000. Well, I think is when they brought they discontinued the three series coupe and bought the bought the four series. I'm not really sure, but um, <clears throat> it's been a while since I've looked at BMWs. I kind of forgot all the facts. Um, <clears throat> I, um, yeah, X5, and then if I <clears throat> end up God lets me maybe a Mini Cooper Clubman. The Clubman is kind of like a of all the Minis. The Clubman is my favorite. I remember when I first saw my uncle pull up in one. My Uncle Dwayne. Um, <clears throat> I kind of liked it. It kind of reminded me of a station wagon, but a uh, Mini at the same time because it's a Mini. Um, <clears throat> and it gives the form of a coupe, but it's very spacious. Um, and it really was, it was really, really cool. Mm. Fun fact, so on the earlier minis when they started bringing in the push button, push button ignition, I don't know if they still do this on the newer minis, but um, that sound you would hear, the chime when you would put the key fob in and start it up, that's actually the same chime people used to hear on the subways back in England. So um, I found that out from my Aunt Angie, that's actually pretty cool. I should be going to see my granddaddy, my Ben daddy tomorrow. It's going to be just for the day again. I'm just dropping my cousins off to go be with my aunt and my their grandmother. Not happy that it's just for the day, but, <clears throat> but you know, I still, but I'm still going to at least see him, so. Yeah, growing up, BMWs, they weren't like, honest, they weren't my life, Jesus is my life, but um, Jesus is the only thing that's my life, if that makes sense, because the Lord, he created me, I'm created through him, <clears throat> but um, they were like in a, <clears throat> they were like a bit, they were a part of my life, BMWs and minis, because every time I would go visit my uncle, he would always... Uh, an uncle there would always be a BMW or a Mini up there um, and I really love just riding around in them <clears throat> so yeah
think I'm putting too much in here. That's why it's popping out. <clears throat> That's why they're popping out. <clears throat> But, um, did I leave my phone there? Oh, I didn't. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go see the fam. <clears throat> and, um, then the next day I'll be going to Special Mixtape Games. I'll try to film that, no promises, just because, um, it'll just mainly be pictures, just because I can't film and play at the same time. I'm gonna be doing basketball this summer, so I'm pretty excited. Summer's been kind of weird. <clears throat> It's the end of May while I'm filming this, and it was kind of weird this May. Um, it was mainly just rain and storms. Um, and of course, we had that thunderstorm that I filmed. Um, But, um, I, uh, <clears throat> I, um, I, um, <clears throat> I'm actually pretty excited to be doing basketball again, um, because they've now switched to where <clears throat> sometimes any athlete, especially an athlete, can do basketball, but then they'll do some years to where that's has to be the real professional, professional ones, um, and my brother Tremaine is actually one of the coaches this year, so I'm actually really excited because I'm actually on his team, so that's even better. <clears throat> and for those of you who aren't caught up yet, um, my brother, he's out, like I said, he's going to be helping me fix the 46 I'm going to make it into kind, of, kind of a sleeper car. I'm going to help him out any way that I can because he's going to be paying for all the, <clears throat> said he'd be paying for all the parts and stuff. Hopefully he'll let me sticker bomb it. I'm trying to convince him to let me. I found some anime. I got into sticker bombing when a friend of mine who was also coaching Special Olympics basketball this year, she, um, I saw her car was a Volkswagen Beetle and I saw the way she designed it. It actually looked pretty cool and she showed me how she sticker bombed it. And it was actually it looked really, really cool. Um, so I figured I might want to try that with my, my brother. He said he'd think about it. <clears throat> Maybe I'll do it anyway after he fixes the car. So you know how big brother, how brothers are. <laughs> if he tells me no. Hopefully he didn't see this. He doesn't see this. <clears throat> You'll ignore that um, sound in the background that's actually my late neighbor's donkey.
Maybe I should just hold it like this. There we go. <clears throat> this time no ashes are coming out this time. <laughs> um, you can kind of get the smell. <clears throat> um, I'm sorry. I know, I know normally I'm very talkative, but yeah, I don't really. I can't really think of anything else to say. Um, I really, if y'all could pray that I can practice more, there's one thing you guys could, I could, I guess, mention, because I really don't want to have to get my permit renewed again, and I don't want to have to, uh, uh, again, I'm not trying to say that I'm ungrateful for the people who have been <clears throat> helping me drive, but and driving me around, but I don't want to have to keep having to rely on somebody or call an Uber or take a bus. Y'all yeah, could just pray that I won't have to go through that much anymore. up to see how do you put um mm. you know I hold the pipe while I'm doing it. Mm. How to keep ashes keep. Mm. hot ashes and cinders from coming out of tobacco pipes. <clears throat> it depends on how you're using the pick. Try running the pick along the same side of the bowl as the air, as the air hole, not the middle.
there's a video on how to do it, or you know, I'll look it up later. Oh, my room is coming out. <clears throat> See ya. No way he's gonna work. Um. <clears throat> Mm. Yep. Yeah, that's pretty much it. It's not really that much ash in there. It's pretty much all ash now, so I'm gonna go ahead and end this cigar video. I'm sorry, I know it wasn't much. I just thought it'd be cool to let <clears throat> to do a video of the pipe since I haven't done that in a while. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe if you did, and I will see you on the next video. Bye guys!